Today is October 26th. I'm super excited to be showing you our greenhouse. We are finishing up a couple of details today so that tomorrow morning we're going to have a crew of people here to put the plastic on top. Once we get the plastic on, it's going to look like it's finished. But we will continue working on it for another four or five months through the winter to finish things up. Uh, we still need to grout the rock wall to get the grout in between and then we need to clean off all the stones to get the concrete off of them so that they're done and it's finished. There will be grout and stone in the around the door so that that'll all be finished up and anyway so there's that project so that'll be a long slow process to finish that up. We'll do that throughout the winter but you can't uh, do the concrete work when it's freezing so that'll be something we'll have to do on warm days. And if we have a super cold winter, then we'll just finish it in the springtime. So that's where we are on the stone wall. But all the big stones are in. There's just a few little ones that will be stuck in to uh, finish up the uh, um, wall. And I'll do that during the grouting process. So the, I can officially say the stone wall is done as far as laying stone. So that's a pretty big accomplishment. I'm it's super awesome. excited about Yay. that. It's so much fun to be able to... Uh, Say the stone wall is finished. Okay, I have this pile of flat stones right here. Most of them have pretty flat attributes. I'm gonna use these on the inside. There's gonna be steps going down in to the greenhouse and there will be a patio platform and we're just gonna use stones to do that. And I'll have to gather more stones. This won't be enough to do that job, but it'll be fun because we'll have a just a place where you where we'll like wash vegetables and when we harvest and all that stuff uh, but that will be and have a place to sit stones. we're gonna have a sitting place so you can sit there and enjoy life we have it we have a belief that if you create living spaces where you work like in your garden and your green space then people will spend more time in them that's right if your garden is ugly and it's nasty and it's gross and you don't want to go there you're not going to grow very much food because it depresses you when you see it. It's kind of like a kitchen sink. I'm sure m most human beings have experienced a kitchen sink that's like really dirty and filthy. You, you it hurts your feelings, you know. <laughs> you don't it's want It's much <laughs> nicer to have a nice clean kitchen. As soon as you eat, clean it up, be done. <laughs> don't leave a big mess there. And that's kind of how I feel with uh, gardening and greenhouses and agriculture. That's why we tried to make it beautiful. We didn't just put in a man door that you could buy somewhere. We made something beautiful so that it will last 500 years because nobody wants to tear it down because it's so wonderful. That's the idea. I uh, like that idea. Behind the way we did this. Um, okay, so anyway, there's an update on the stone wall. We're done with this segment of it. Um, the grouting segment will start but I'm not going to start that for probably two or three weeks because as soon as we get the plastic on, then we'll go inside and we'll start creating the garden. Oh, and we're gonna that's start exciting. <laughs> um, and the little bit, bitty holes that are still in here that will be sealed up in the grouting process. Yeah, that's okay because we're not heating the greenhouse. Um, so a little bit of ventilation is just fine to start growing plants this winter. All right. Um, see you later.